more information there. And uh, then one final note, uh, BYU announcing that uh, their series with Utah State will be discontinued after this year. Uh, they will play on September the 29th, but then after that, it's off to the Big 12. And so with them entering the Big 12 in 2023, uh, they are going ahead and moving that game off of their schedule. So BYU and Utah State no more, thanks to the Cougars moving on to the Big 12 starting next season. Mm. And uh, those are a few things that are off the radar. Yeah, I, 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 that's part of the attrition of all these changes in college athletics, expansion and whatever else is uh, some rivalries are going uh, kaput. Uh, there are some. If they ever mess with Army Navy, I'm fighting. That's all I'm going to well, say. Well, they'll never be in conferences, so or nah, as I far know, as I it, know, affected I, by that. You but, never know. I mean, you never know. Well, Maybe. I mean, would you trade Utah State for, uh, I don't know, Oklahoma and Oklahoma State, you know, for a couple years, uh, Baylor, Texas Tech? I mean, I know there's a rivalry aspect to it, but you can also see why. I mean, they're, they're moving to the Big 12, and part of moving is changes. And, uh, yeah, so for right now, that's at least a change, and they could, of course, always uh, – you know, add them again later on at some point. They but. have. I'm trying to find out how long that rivalry might be. You could. They've played 90 times, 90 times uh, in their history. So that's a pretty lengthy. That's pretty lengthy. But you know, you're right. It's uh, you got you got other things you got to deal with. You got a new conference, and and Brigham Young's going to still play one or two of the non-conference games at a pretty high level that they're they're used to doing. When we come back, uh, we've got a young.